joining us today. My name is Stephen Olikar. I'm the founder and president of the Millennial Action Project, and we could not be more thrilled to be here in Arkansas to launch our 20th State Future Caucus. And I just want to express my deep gratitude uh, to our bipartisan co-chairs here, Representative Sturch and Sabin, uh, for not only their leadership, but also really uh, their friendship. It's really been a pleasure getting to know you guys. This caucus will be composed of members of the Arkansas State Legislature, both senators and representatives who are under 45 years old. And their goal has been to really capture the energy of the millennial generation to really try to uh, bring a new approach to politics here in the United States, uh, which is something I think we desperately need. Uh, the millennial generation in particular is really focused on problem solving. Uh, they're probably the generation that's least interested in partisanship uh, in many, many decades here in the United States. That generation, 18 to 40, is the largest percentage of age group population in Arkansas. And we actually have over 30 representatives and senators who are in that age group. And so we're hoping that together, as uh, Representative Saban mentioned, that we can come together and find innovative ideas and solutions to today's problems, especially ones that face young people, whether that be student loan debt, adult literacy rates, teenage pregnancy, whatever it might be that we know will have an impact on our future in this state, but also across the country. So what we want to do is solve problems. And I think this Future Caucus is going to give us the chance to promote more innovation in government, to create more efficiency, but also to make sure that we're taking advantage of the new tech economy. That's our goal, is to make sure that Arkansas is a better place to live, to work, and to raise a family. So I'm excited about this new innovative opportunity, and I hope that you'll keep up with us as we move forward. Thank you very much.